After hosting governors and the leadership of the National Assembly to Iftar, this time President Bola Tinubu is having a Ramadan dinner with members of the federal judiciary. They were led to the presidential villa by the Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Olukayode Ariwola. Speaking, President Bola Tinubu condemned the reprehensible act perpetrated by kidnappers across the country, declaring that individuals involved in such despicable crimes must be treated as terrorists. Kidnappers are terrorists and don't rule against us. That's the way we perceive them. That is the way we must treat them. On the review of salary of judicial officers, the president pledged that his administration would continue to implement necessary reforms to improve the welfare and working condition of judicial officers. President Tinubu expressed gratitude to the judiciary for their dedicated service to the nation, acknowledging their role in upholding the respectability of the judicial arm of government. For his part, the Chief Justice of Nigeria commended the President Bola Tinubu-led administration for achieving a significant milestone by appointing a full complement of 21 justices to the Supreme Court, a feat he described as unprecedented. For the first time, the administration now has the full complement of the Supreme Court. We are 21 justices now. The Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation, Latif Fabemi, expressed gratitude to President Tinubu for forwarding the executive bill titled Judicial Office Holders Salary and Allowances Bill 2024 to the National Assembly, highlighting the stagnant state of judges' salary and a monument since 2007, Fabemi commended the president's courage, determination, and compassion in taking decisive action. From the Asorok Presidential Villa, Amikaro Atta, ITV News.